Now, the On Your Side forecast. Good evening, everybody. 10 after 10 right now, and it is pretty cold this evening. 47 degrees right now in Boise. Feels more like 43, and it's just going to continue to get colder, especially with these overnight temperatures over the next couple of days. Right now, it's 46 in Mountain Home, only 35 degrees in Twin Falls. They're already nearing that freezing temperature for this evening. Our current wind gusts, they have died down a lot from what they were sitting at earlier. 20 mile per hour wind speeds in Bogus Basin right now. Only 10 right now in Boise, 18 in CUNA. We had upwards of 40 mile per hour wind gusts in some of the areas in the Treasure Valley today. Not enough to blow your garbage can down the street or into your neighbor's yard like we've all had before, but enough to knock them over. My hair was all over the place as I left off for work this morning, so it was pretty windy. Those temperatures felt a little bit cooler than what we were expecting. 32 degrees will be the overnight low in Boise see tonight 29 in Mountain Home 34 in Ontario not quite reaching that freezing benchmark 28 in Idaho City only 12 degrees overnight in Stanley tonight this is a look at the clouds we'll be seeing not a whole lot of anything but this is the freeze warning that's in effect from Ontario all through the Treasure Valley and clear into Twin Falls then this is a hard freeze warning in that Burley area just east of us in the Magic Valley it's going to be cool lots of snow coming down in those Magic Valley areas Frost likely tonight and then tomorrow temperatures dipping even more into that 25 degree benchmark in some of the valley locations across the Treasure Valley and the Magic Valley. From there, temperatures continue to increase and will be warming by the middle to the end of next week. This is that cooler weather that's coming from the north, coming from Canada and bringing us those cooler temperatures. Montana is really cold snow across the entire state. If you're in Yellowstone this weekend, you'll likely be snowed on. But there are pleasant temperatures just to our west. They're about mid 70s in the Portland area and so that's kind of keeping our temperatures in the middle and then we'll be warming up by the middle of next week. The snow, like I said, in Montana and then if you're in Yellowstone this weekend likely will get snowed on. Just a little bit of snow to the south of Twin Falls in those higher elevations. It's going to be a cold next couple of days. Your high temperatures for tomorrow. 53 will be that high in Boise, 46 in McCall and 44 in Twin Falls. Our high temperatures across the rest of the United States are just really cool, mostly in the northwest. 47 degrees will be that high in Salt Lake City because we have this warmer weather to our west and then this cooler weather up here. They're just kind of pushing together and bringing us near 53 degrees. So we're still pretty cold, but we're not quite as cold as in Utah. Our temperatures will be warming over the next couple of days after Monday. This is this warming trend and they'll be back up near normal over the next couple of days by the middle of next week. As far as your Treasure Valley forecast for Sunday, 57 will be that high in Vail, 58 the highest temperature across the Treasure Valley in Ontario and in Weezer. It will be a sunny clear day tomorrow, but cool wind speeds northwest about 10 miles per hour. 55 will be that high in Garden Valley and 51 degrees in Idaho City, sunny and clear in the west and east central mountains. 54 that high in Riggins, a 20 degree low in McCall overnight tonight. 42 will be the high in Stanley and the 20 degree low in McCall suddenly doesn't feel too bad. 12 degree low in Stanley overnight tonight. Our Magic Valley forecast really cold lows below freezing 27 degrees in Twin Falls and 46 will be that high tomorrow. Your extended forecast we're warming back up for Monday. 56 degrees will be the high Monday 60 for Tuesday and then that warming trend just continues through the middle of next week and into the end of the week. 60 will be that high Tuesday warming up near 64 degrees on Wednesday 65 Thursday and then right where we should be for Friday and Saturday. 66 and 67 degrees. That's right near average for this time of year. It's going to feel good. I'm over the end of fall like temperatures. Yeah, well, so we might have some frosted wind chills yes. the next couple days. If right? you've got, you know, flowers outside, <laughs> plants in the garden, they will Prepare. probably die. So bring them inside. <laughs> yes. All right. Sounds good.